Evening, I'm Dana Tyler. We start with video surveillance cameras. They're almost everywhere as more and more businesses and homes are installing them for extra security. But a proposed bill in New Jersey could mean those private cameras have to be registered with police. Many store owners like the idea, but homeowners worry about privacy. CBS 2's Alice Gaynor here now with details. Alice. Dana, law enforcement and sponsors of the bill say this measure is all about saving time, not infringing on privacy. They point to recent use of surveillance video that helped to find a kidnapped Philadelphia woman. This surveillance video was crucial in helping to figure out who abducted a 22-year-old Philadelphia woman off a city street. The cameras that were available helped uh, identify people. So. New Jersey Assemblyman Ralph Caputo cites that example as one of the many ways in which surveillance video can aid police in the fastest way possible. These police departments, county police and prosecutors are overburdened. Uh, they want to be able to uh, uh, find these individuals as quickly as they can. He's co-sponsored legislation that would require the registration of commercial and private outdoor video cameras with local police departments. This only assists them in terms of time. They don't have to canvas an entire area to look for the cameras. They'll know where they are. The private outdoor video surveillance camera registry would require the name of the camera owner, the address and phone number of the owner, the street address where it's installed, the number of cameras, outdoor areas recorded by the camera, and how the footage is stored or saved. I think it's good for our safety, for safety for the stars. This Newark store owner is on board, but not everyone thinks it's fair, in particular homeowners. I think that's a violation. You know, that's a violation of people's rights to privacy. Caputo stresses there's no enforcement to say you must actually show the video. This is just so police know where to ask. A video is going to assist uh, people from being, you know, prosecuted illegally or uh, victimized uh, in, the, in the wrong way. So I don't see, I think this is good for, for law enforcement, it's good for people. Okay. The cameras don't lie. Now, if passed, the measure states that those who do not register a camera could be punished with fines up to $100. Dana? Alice, thank you. We want to know what you think. Should businesses and homeowners be required to register their private outdoor surveillance cameras with local police departments? Take our poll right now on CBSNewYork.com.